Hello, my name is Matthew Kelly and I'm an intern here at Home TV. And today I'm sitting down with Ken Lane, the Economic Development Director here in Meridian Township. Today we're going to discuss a new business moving into the old Toys R Us building. So Ken, please tell us a little bit more about this new development coming to the Toys R Us here in Meridian Township. Uh, Klingman's Furniture out of Grand Rapids purchased the building um, and there was a lot of uh, effort to make that a, a possibility. Um, my pre predecessor, uh, Chris Buck, who was the former economic development director, uh, the township manager, Frank Walsh, and then when I came on board myself, um, that building, uh, Home Depot had a lot of use restrictions on it, which makes sense because they don't want to have something competing with them to move into that space. So we worked with Home Depot to get some of those uh, restrictions loosened and then to allow Klingman's to move in there and then Klingman's financing uh, company wanted some more uh, restrictions loosened so we worked to, to get through that. Um, so it was a pretty lengthy process but at the end we're very happy to say that Klingman's Furniture bought the building and they'll be moving in there um, and work is underway already. Is it going to be like like a showroom, a sales floor? It's going to be a showroom. It's going to be, a, the Clemens is a high-end uh, furniture retailer. So it, it's going to be, the, you know, the, the only thing I think of is it's going to be similar to like an art van furniture where you walk in and they have furniture displayed throughout the uh, facility and then you can interact with their salespeople to buy what you want. So... Was there a process Clemens had to go through um, with the township in order to be able to obtain the building? Not to obtain the building. That was strictly uh, involving Home Depot. Clemens, the, uh, a retailer of uh, furniture is a permitted use where the building is located. So they are in the process now of um, working with the building department for the work they're planning to do. But in terms of purchasing the building, no, there, there was nothing they had to do with the township. Um, so about how close are they to opening? They're, they'd like to open end of September, early October. That's, that's what Clemens, uh, that's their um, ideal time. Was the building used for anything else since Toys R Us was first closed? Uh, the sort of that seasonal Halloween store uh, did operate out of there at least one Halloween season. Um, but I don't think they were back there last year. So it, it, was briefly used for that. I think it's called Halloween uh, is the name of the store. It was used for that, but nothing besides that. How do you think this new store will benefit Meridian Township? I think it'll be a huge benefit to the to the township and the residents of the township in that we really haven't had a high-end furniture retail store of that size in the township. Um, in years past, residents would have to drive to the west side of the Lansing area to go to Art Van or one of those stores out there. So now they're gonna be able to just head over to um, the Newman Road location and shop there for their furniture needs. Have you heard any comments or remarks from the public about the new store? The only thing I've heard has been positive so far. Everyone's excited. I, I've seen some chatter about it on Nextdoor and on Facebook and everyone's very excited about Klingman's moving in. So tell me about some of the other economic developments that are coming to Meridian Township. Well, we've got quite a bit, a lot going on on Grand River. Um, you know, Klingman's is a block up on Newman Road, but um, sort of, if you come back down to Grand River in the former Pizza Hut that was uh, sort of across the street from the Rite Aid, Anna's House, which is a, a restaurant that they have several locations throughout Michigan. Um, they're gonna be opening up soon. They're underway uh, doing their interior work now, and we're excited about that. And then traveling down Grand River near Best Buy, uh, the Burger King is gone. I don't know if you noticed that. Uh, but the Burger King moved out and Buddy's Pizza out of the Detroit area is going to be moving in there. They're going to actually demolish the Burger King and build a whole new building. And then across the street from that, on the corner where Leo's Lodge used to be, um, there's a shop, little shopping center that's going in that's going to house a Chipotle, an Aspen Dental, and a couple other um, retailers that we don't know who yet, but we're uh, expecting that to hold four or five tenants when it's all said and done. Is there anything else you'd like to say? Just that, you know, we're, we're excited that uh, construction's back, uh, back at it after the, the shutdown and um, 
projects that were proposed uh, seem to be moving forward. So we're hoping to keep the momentum rolling and, and have uh, good things come to Meridian Township. Well, thank you, Ken, for joining us today. Please be sure to stay tuned for Home TV for the latest Meridian Township news.